would love to share with you guys all day today, I have a very busy day, what I eat when I'm out and about. So this morning, I woke up at 5.45 and I had a half a cup of warm water with lemon. And then I had my rice milk, coconut milk latte with just one shot of espresso that I make at home myself. Whoa, this hair. I'm actually waiting. I'm going to get my hair cut with Patrick Melville. So this is the before. I'll show you the after. And then I brought with me, I brought a banana. So I'll have the banana whenever I start getting hungry. And then I brought my avocado and a gluten-free English muffin. And I usually will have this an hour and a half after I have that second banana. And yesterday I, I got lunch from Sweet Green and I got two salads. I highly recommend doing this. So when you're picking up a salad, think about your next day. And if you have a crazy day and you're, you're usually like sitting at your office or your desk, like, I don't know what the hell to order, pick up two of the same thing and get the dressing on the side. I don't love eating a, a ton in the morning. I wait until I'm hungry. So I started to get hungry about 7.15, and then I had my spirulina smoothie, sm smoothie, smoothie. Half a water, don't mind my one-handed action. Mm. Got a half a cup of coconut water, one banana, handful of baby spinach. I use, ah, <laughs> all of these raspberries. This is what happens when you're running late for school. Half a date, two ice cubes, half a squeezed lemon, one. Yeah. Yeah, oh, yes, please. And a half. Peeling this now and tossing it in. Go. smoothie with an extra boost of the hum nutrition powder that I love it has more probiotics adaptogens and it just gives me a nice boost so that's the start of the morning and stay tuned for more of what I eat in a day the man of the hour Patrick Melville and I'm at his new spa and this man has been cutting my hair forever cream tea with me so I make it at home and I put half ice cream tea and half water so all the time the second I get to the office I have my gluten-free gluten-free English muffins with avocado and I'm obsessed with this organic garlic sea salt so this is my salad from sweet green that I ordered yesterday and in this one I have romaine sweet potatoes bean sprouts corn cabbage carrots, and onions. And I have a mix of my simple salad dressing and a little bit of their spicy cashew. While I'm unpacking my groceries, I'm just finishing up my homemade green juice. Always, at least once a day. So let's start with, I always get greens and I got the, this wheatgrass to juice. Organic carrot noodles. I try to buy things that are somewhat prepared to just make things a little easier in the kitchen. Romaine salad already chopped, so I can bring salads to work really easily. Mushrooms, always avocados. I always buy berries, so strawberries, blackberries. I always buy apples, bananas, but I already have those. I'm obsessed with these Amy's gluten-free non-dairy burritos. They're so delicious and just such a quick go-to, something I eat occasionally. Brussels sprouts. These Beyond Meat burgers, which are plant-based patties, they're so delicious, either as like, you can make them as a burger or add them on salads or make a stir fry with them. Let's see, I was at Whole Foods, which I don't go to all the time, but it's like, it's, I literally feel like I'm on a shopping spree when I'm there because they have so many amazing things. So I, I bought these fingerling potatoes to make 
uh, for Benjamin and they were just, they looked so delicious. So I usually make them myself, but once in a while I'll buy things that are already prepared. I usually don't buy things like this, but it looked delicious. I always buy a gluten-free granola for coconut yogurts or Benjamin eats this alone with coconut milk. This brand I love. Always, always organic sauerkraut. This is the organic apple juice I buy for B if I'm not juicing it and making it myself. These are the Yum Earth organic vegan gluten-free lollipops I buy for Benjamin that are just a little treat I have around. The toothpaste, the all natural toothpaste I use. I love this brand, Jason, and I particularly love Sea Fresh. So once in a while I'll buy these organic uh, potatoes as french fries, or yes, that's what they are, Melissa. They are organic french fries. First time trying these Siete grain-free tortilla chips. I always buy a mix of rice milk and coconut milk. I'm trying these for the first time. I like this brand. Uh, these are a little high in sugar, but it's just a treat. And I always buy really good bread. I love this whole grain sprouted bread. And then I buy a mix of these gluten-free English muffins. A huge piece of aloe to juice. I got a couple assorted peppers. I think that's everything. I'm having the weirdest dinner ever, but I'm sharing it with you. I'm making this homemade guacamole and I put in onions, tomatoes, and sauerkraut. Don't ask, it's good for gut health. And I'm shooting tomorrow and my little man, when I, can't, I haven't seen him that much today and it kind of hurts my heart and he, said he's really hungry when I got home, so we're letting him stay up a little later. And then, in the toaster oven, I have one of my Amy's burrito. It's just beans and rice, no cheese, vegan, and simple, easy. I, w I usually have this with a salad, but I had the biggest salad for lunch, and I just need a little something, because I'm hungry, but I'm not starving, and this is kind of what I'm feeling like. So, send any questions, comment below and that's a wrap for tonight can't wait to sleep good night